Right, so we're back. We're here at um, Gorse Deal Fisheries, a, a local, a local um, fishing lake for me and Chris. Yeah, it's about ten minutes from our house. <coughs> ten minutes from our house. Um, like John said, it's local to us. Um, there's two lakes on here. There's a specimen, which is just over here, and the main water, which is one we're fishing on. Say we want a couple of runs, hopefully, and a bit more content for you guys. That's that's the plan, really, isn't it, mate? Um, well, yeah, we're just trying to get a few runs and put a few fish in the bank and have, have a good day, like. Yeah, man. Um, so yeah, today I'm I'm fishing like we're fishing in the top left-hand corner of the lake, and I'm fishing uh, I am fishing right into the left like corner. Um, I've got my little knife what's out today. I'm on uh, on my left rod. I've got a little Ronnie, about um, six inch boom, a little white pop up on. Um, Try to get it as balanced as possible, crit critically balanced, if you if you will, as they say. Um, with a little mesh bag around it, and uh, on my right rod, pretty much the same approach again. Little mesh bag with uh, a slip D this time. Um, just a little, little little rigs, little hooks. Really, the fish aren't massive in here. There's a few good, good like upper doubles. Probably even you know, 20, 20 in here, honestly. That's my approach today. What's yours, Chris? Yeah, so me similar sort of approach to you. So my left rod is straight out in front of me on a solid bag with the uh, Pacific Tuna bag mix in and then some clean juice in it just to add that a bit more attraction. The hook bait oh, is the Nor Northern Special um, Wafter. Uh, what colour have you on with in there? Yellow one. Nice, yeah. nice. Good choice. And my right hand rod I've gone for just a plain out Pacific Tuna Wafter with a couple of freebies chucked over the top. And that was with a mesh bag with some small two mil pellets in with it. Nice, mate. That's my nice. approach. I got my head out this sunroof. I'm blasting my favorite tunes. I only got one thing on my mind. You got me stuck on the thought of you. You're making me feel brand new. You're more than a sunshine in my eyes. You got those. So yeah, pretty mad really. Um, literally just uh, cast it out, just past this little uh, floating island thing. And the next minute I had an absolute ripper while put my rod on the rest. Um, but, uh, yeah, so we're currently in into our third, fourth fish we've been into actually. Yeah, into our fourth fish here, but. Um, as at the moment, I'm gonna go underneath Chris's line. It does feel a heavier fish, but I don't know if it's much bigger to be honest. Um, but yeah, just literally just setting this on my uh, on my rest and. Uh, Yeah. <laughs> 
so we're having a bit of a mare. As you can see, John's into one right now. We've got we've got two in this net. And then we've got two in this net as well. So yeah, we've had an absolute fucking mare. Loads of fucking we don't know who is who's. Absolute carnage, mate. So a lot of common. A little, a little mirror. It's not very big, like, but there's five fish here. Just to get them back. Come on. It's been two seconds after maybe I like that. Literally, yeah, we're an absolute savage, savage session here. Let's just get them back. They aren't they? This is the one I caught. It's probably eight or nine pounds. Oh, Chris, lied about me. Oh. But it's been absolutely fucking carnage. Get the fucking rods back out and have a few more, eh? <sighs> right, so we're back. I just thought uh, we'd do an overview because it's been that, that much carnage. We've, we've had that many fish on the bank. Um, yeah, I just thought we'd come to you and show you what, the, what, what, what we're doing and, and like... And yeah, in a bit more detail. So yeah, like we said, I've got a, a little pop-up combi rig out on my right rod and a slip D on a long shank to my, on, on my left rod. Fishing them both with little tiny mesh bags, literally probably 18, 20 mil boily size. And that's it. That's what's done the fucking do all day, really. What about you, Chris? Still fishing straight out in front of me towards that black... Uh, island or whatever you want to call it. Flotation device. Flotation device. <laughs> yeah, that one on, on the essential cells <coughs> kind of deed, so that's, yeah. what, that's what I'm doing. Essential cells done well for me as well, mate, honestly. With the uh, little mesh bags. I've literally about half an hour changed my right rod to that. Maybe I should have done it earlier. Cast that back out, same again. Essential cell, mini pellets in the middle mesh bag. And we've gone actually gone quiet now, haven't we? So we yeah. have to thought, we'll just do a little update. But if you don't see any more fish from the bank from us, you'll probably do the last update in the car on the way home. But right. yeah. Peace. Sound. See you in a bit. Right, so uh, yeah, the car's packed, we're in the car, we, we just started to head home, just thought we'd give you one last little update, um, so after the last update we had no fish, uh, what was your overview today mate? Yeah, it was good, it was fun, um, say what we expected, a couple of runs, a couple of pasties and some oh, that sizes really, weren't they? Yeah, it started getting bigger, didn't it, there's a um, sort of thing, yeah, I mean that's what's done now, uh, make sure you uh, go across to our Instagram and uh, TikTok and drop us a follow on Insta and TikTok, it's plugging all on there. That's it, yeah, that's it. We, we're always being active on Instagram Instagram and TikTok. Uh, always feel free to message as well if you need advice on a venue or whatever. To, yeah, go for it. Yeah, and make sure you can uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell button for when um, our next videos come up because we'll be plenty more coming. That's it. Right, now peace. Thanks. See you in a bit. <laughs>